Good morning, guys. How are you? Uh, so it's it's just beautiful out, man. It's it's beautiful outside, and uh, so we're gonna get going. It's currently 6:49, 6:49. So it's beautiful out. We are going to get going and get this day started. So probably just going to piddle around, show you some properties. Might get some footage for you. Uh, we probably will, honestly. But uh, let's let's go. Let's let's move on and start this day. All right, guys. Look, I just want to show you all this property real quick and talk a minute about this trimmer. Uh, that I've been using the crap out of. Okay, so here's the property. Uh, nice little property. <laughs> and uh, got the edges all cleaned up. All right, look, let's talk about this 2320T. This little thing, look, the best thing you're gonna like about this, I've been hearing this a lot, 225, leaking oil, blah, blah, blah. Look at this, guys, no oil. <coughs> no oil. So I've been using it for about probably got around 10 hours on it but uh man this this little thing for weekly properties is absolutely freaking great uh this is my go-to trimmer now when i don't need all of the power that the the red max puts out so uh 2320t literally just 225 on steroids supposedly the engine has different internals and stuff so uh you know so far i am really really enjoying this trimmer just for the weekly properties. Now, when you start getting into some thick stuff, it does handle it, but it don't handle it like a 2620, 2620T, you know, anything like that. Red Max 260, totally night and day difference. But weekly properties, things like that, this thing is totally awesome. So, uh, and for a 250 price tag, hey, you really can't go wrong, especially if you find a, uh, a deal you know a one day sale at your dealer or something for 15 percent off then you get this thing for you know 30 37 dollars off uh so you know uh just wanted to give you all an update on that show you the property and uh tell you a little bit about the 2320t so moving on all right look check this out one thing i want to talk about about these twills man i really love about this and i want to show you firsthand what I'm talking about. When he comes out and he turns around, there's no black marks left from these tires. Watch this. There's no black marks left from these tires. So, these things, uh, you really have to make a sharp turn. Now these are from, <clears throat> all these are from uh, tires, not the mower. But you really have to make, like these right here, really have to have to make a real sharp turn in order to leave any marks on the pavement with these tires I mean which pretty much you have to set it there and just rotate it uh, before you're going to leave any marks really really love that about the twills so here's the mud So here's this property. We're going to uh, show you the aftermath of it, but uh, I wanted to show you the twill thing and show you really uh, in person why I'm not just talking crap. They really do not leave black marks. Totally amazing to me. But uh, we're gonna get the back mode here. I'm gonna mow the back with the 60. Um, he's gonna take care of the front and by the pool area and stuff. So uh, let's get going. All right, guys, got it done, taken care of. We got the back knocked out as well. So, uh, yeah, moving on, moving on. Getting everything blowed off here, and it would we are out. All right, guys, here's the next one. Y'all have seen it before, but uh, we're going to get this one knockered out. It looks like we're going to finally be able to get this one under control again because it normally grows like crazy, man. So uh, here's before show you after all right guys got that one done fixing to blow it off look at them edges look at them edges jared left who did that I did. all right all right <clears throat> so we got to blow this off guys and uh yeah man so he normally 
likes this property cut very very short but uh we haven't been able to get it under control because man it's just been grow this is one of them yards that grow very very fast and so uh you literally find yourself i mean you just can't double and triple cut it every week but this week we got lucky and uh so we got you know we got it lowered to uh, three and a quarter he likes this cut <clears throat> he likes it cut at about two and a half um but uh you know i think it looks good at three and a quarter three really makes this lawn look good you know you just got some lawns that really look good uh short and then other ones that just don't look good short whatsoever this is one of them lawns that look good short so uh anyway um as y'all remember i used to live right there across the street and uh yeah this used to be my neighborhood so uh all right guys moving on get you some more footage here all right guys another one done down and out hang that out the window jj rod show them what's up man show them show them what you can do uh you can really can't see that we'll have to show them to you from a different direction but we will show them to you so uh that one's knocked out taken care of moving on to the next one guys stay tuned all right guys we're at the next one we're uh back in the trailer up here we're gonna show you this strap leaves in this bad boy we're gonna get this one knocked out and move on so uh yeah we'll we'll show you the aftermath here once we're done so uh i look like an idiot wearing a long sleeve don't i, I bet people think i'm retarded they're like what is this fat guy doing wearing a long sleeve shirt guys i'm telling you you got to try it uh absolutely amazing i can't honestly believe it but you got to think of it like this you don't have the sun actually hitting your skin keeping you hot uh it's a different kind of hot but it's really not hot and once you start sweating in it because i'm a fat guy so i sweat a lot when you start sweating in it i mean it just feels great feels great so uh anyway we're gonna get this one knocked out and show you the aftermath so stay tuned Woo! get down bud get out now this property is cut at three two five three two five beautiful man we'll show you from the other side over here let's get this blown off Hey, steel fans. Hey, steel fans. Look at this. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. This is how a piece of equipment should start, Ray. Tomco. Look, let me sit y'all up here. Y'all know. Y'all ready? Y'all ready? This is how it should start. What? What? Oh! Echo all day, baby. Echo all day. What is all that crap? You're gonna have to wash the mowers. <laughs> all right, let's get this blown off. Let me show you then. Danny did that. That's a Danny strap right there. Man, just look at that. We'll get over there. Y'all don't get too jealous. We'll get over there. Take a minute, okay? Let me blow this off. We'll be over there. We'll be over there. It's all right. Oh, look at that. Or another one. All 
right, yeah. Always blow the AC. <laughs> Always blow that AC. <coughs> Regardless of whether you did it or not, blow it. Blow it. That. That. I don't want none of that. I don't want none of that. What is that? Yeah. That's some three and a quarter drought stripes, baby. Z Master. Oh, no kit. No wheel on the back of the deck. Uh, no scalp wheel neither on the back. These things have literally, uh, these things have like, look at that. They have literally bent. I mean, look, they're like an egg shape now. <laughs> so funny. This one's not like that. That one's not that bad. I'm not sure why this one is. Hmm. I don't see nothing wrong with it. But y'all see that? It looks like an egg. The other side don't look like an egg. This side don't look like, oh, maybe it does. Okay, never mind. Never mind, it looks like an egg too. Twills, man. 100 hour review coming up on these bad boys. 100 hour review coming up. Lock it in. Cha-ching. Uh, I know. I know Tom Coe and Ray Ray don't know nothing about that starting on first pull stuff, but you know, uh, let's get out of here, show you this, move on. Hold that, JJ Rod. <laughs> let's do it, look at that. All right, here we go, y'all ready? Y'all Ray Ray, damn, oh man, okay, here we go, here we go. Let me get y'all the, the angle here. Them Danny, oh my goodness. I don't know if y'all see that. Uh, uh, uh. I, I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, all right, moving on to the next one. The neighbor actually stopped us and uh, asked us to give him an estimate. So uh, let's stop in here and give him an estimate. <clears throat> we will just park right here. And uh, we'll be back. All right, boys. Got that one done. I don't know if you can see back here, but that's a two acre property man and it gets mowed short when i say short i mean short we'll show you how short uh as i back out of here um it's it's short so <clears throat> we are done for the day it is hot 96 96 look at that 96 boys it's hot it's hot okay it's hot uh it's hot but i will tell you this shirt i don't know about this shirt it's pretty pretty cool uh so anyway we'll show you this uh <laughs> real quick here um two and a half inches this is what you get at two and a half and uh, stick you out the other side there and show you 2.5 boys, 2.5. And uh, yeah, so that's what you get, 2.5. Crazy, crazy short, but it's one of them properties that look good short. So uh, we got everything done, got everything blew off. We are done. We are done. So, uh, good thing there's a breeze out. That's always good. But, uh, yeah. You happy to be done? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, you're always happy to be done. 
<laughs> that guy don't even like to work. I don't even know what his deal is. But uh, anyway, that's going to do it for this video, guys. Uh, we're going to stop by my buddies real quick, talk about some fireworks. He's setting up a firework tent. And uh, I'm going to go home and unload this stuff and relax in 80 degree weather in my house. So uh, y'all enjoy. Y'all have a good one. And we will talk to you soon. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Getting close to that 10K mark. Maybe one day we'll hit it. <laughs>